All right, everybody. Welcome back. It's been a while, but we are now officially in the Backyard Baseball Season 5 playoffs. So here we go. We're in the post game now. This is where things generally really pick up difficulty wise. And boy, howdy is it about to pick up because we had a very close call in game 14 against the Blue Jays. And guess who we're facing off in the playoffs? The Blue Jays. Time for more clanky. Oh boy, that's uh, that's that's gonna be rough. Even though Clanky is honestly one of the least scary characters on their team, it's more Jay Green that I'm worried about. So let's see our roster. <laughs> hey, it's a we're playing Super Colossal though. That's pretty nice. All right, let's let's see what our player stats are like. Harry Potter's though doing good. So is Ricky. The twins. Oh, Ashley now has the increases. Ashley is as fast as Pete Wheeler today. That's fantastic. Pablo's back to normal. That's great. We need you for the post game. Sally does not have the fielding decrease, even though Ronnie Dobbs is on the opposing team. Interesting. So she doesn't always get a stat penalty. No, Pete! That's not good. Team captain is... He's like, I took a week off and forgot how to play baseball. You forgot how to run too, Pete. Well, great, that's a liability. But Ernie is fine. No, Angela, you too? Well, I guess it's not huge decreases, but... Uh-oh. Hmm. All right. Well, folks, we're going to have a little bit of a change of pace, I think, in the batting lineup. So Harry Potter's going to start this time, and then we're going to have Ashley Weber. And then we're going to have Pablo. And then I think Sally is going to be the cleanup hitter. Then I think Sydney and Pete. I don't want... Mm, actually, okay, hang on. Pete's... He's not super slow, but he's slow enough. I just don't want him to get double plays. It's going to be... Hmm. I don't really want... Or actually, no, wait, never mind. Ricky's kind of fast. Okay, so Ernie's going to move up. Angela's going to sandwich between the two kind of fast players, so hopefully we can avoid double plays. Um... Oh, yeah, that's right. Sally's the pitcher. We're still going to have Angela as our main pitcher. I don't think we really want Pete in the out. Well, it depends on what his arm's like. We'll keep him as the catcher for now. And if he's got if he's got a bad arm, then we might have to put him somewhere else. Otherwise, though, I think that's going to be pretty good for our side. So, all right. Well, that's our team. Let's see what's up with them. So, Frances Bluer, she actually gets a batting increase. Cool. It wasn't enough that she was a 9 at batting. We need to give her the perfect 10. Jose Meisenheimer is the usual. Jay Green, big decreases. Okay, that's nice. He's still scary, but less so. Ronnie Dobbs is normal. Clanky is perfect, as always. Uh, Scotty Roth, he's a terror. Watch out. So, he will just launch things out of a cannon. Randolph Glukert, he's the guy who got way too many home runs for no reason. Vic Souffle is not too scary, and Raul is also, even though he's a professional, is also not super scary. Okay, so we got some decreases, they got some decreases. It, so it kind of balances out. We got more than they did, but Jay Green getting taken down is a huge relief, because he is definitely their best player. All right, well, Canada's bringing their A game today. But it's home field advantage for us, so without further ado, let's get started with the playoffs. The excitement level is high as the players prepare for their first game in this playoff series. Reporting to you directly from the Super Colossal Dome, this is Sunny Day and Minnie the Gooch. This afternoon will feature a fierce competition between the Toronto Blue Jays and the Super Duper One. Now that we're in the playoffs, the competition is a little rougher. And you can bet these kids will be playing their hearts out. Alrighty then, it's time for some baseball. The crowd is on their feet now, stomping and clapping for the best team in the BBL, the Wombats. Woo, go Wombats. All right, well, here we go. Rematch against the Blue Jays, Mr. Clanky's Revenge. Let's play ball. All right, Gotti Ruff. He's not such a much. I mean, he's absolutely terrifying as their catcher. Maybe, maybe, ooh, maybe we can make them sub Clanky out for their pitcher and for Scotty instead. There we go. Okay, even with decreases, Angela's got a good enough arm to get it to Ernie. Good job, Angela. All right, here we go. Slow ball to Raul. He's still scary, but yikes. Yep, there we go. All right, Pablo. I, I, 
This is not a good start, folks. Nice triple for Raul! I gotta give him that! That was a genuinely good hit! I really wanted to just barely nick the strike zones to give him no chance at a good hit. Cool. Alright, Ricky, this is you. Ricky? To Angela! <laughs> Showing up! She's like, Ricky can't do this. Angela just double played. That's huge! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Ooh, underground. That's pretty nice. Alright, let's see if Harry can get... Oh, we're gonna have to hit it away from Scotty, otherwise we're not getting on base. Harry, you can beat a robot. Okay, that's a pop fly, but maybe they don't catch it. No, no, they do. Over Clanky's head? Yeah, over Clanky's head. Nice single, Ashley. Alright, we'll swing at this one. No. Back, 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 back. Thank goodness that... Wow, that... Scotty, you gotta go easy on the throwing. Jeez Louise, you just clocked that kid in the face. All right, Sally, this is your big moment. That's not good. Maybe he drops it. And there you go. <laughs> Scotty just... Scotty can throw the ball harder than anybody in human history. But sometimes it just bonks him on the face. All right. Well, we got two people on base. Two outs. Let's undergrounder it. Especially since both my characters are fast on base. Okay. Oh, okay. He's going to have a good arm. Slide, side, side. Thank goodness their second baser was off base. Wow. Well, probably shouldn't have made that, but we did anyways. Thank you, Backyard Baseball. Ooh, got another one. Ernie's definitely going to use it. Again, second and third. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yuck, yuck. I'm Ernie Steele, and I'm about to steal this game from you. Because we got another undergrounder. <laughs> that is literally cheating. <laughs> Sorry, robot. Kids got to win this game. Does not compute. Does not compute. So I heard from comments in the last video, apparently... I was wondering why they took Clanky off the mound because he wasn't tired. Apparently, if your team scores five points, the opposing team will automatically switch their pitcher. So that's why Clanky got taken down. So if we can get five points, they will swap Clanky out for someone inferior. Recalibrating. Error, error. Accuracy offline. Dear Lord, not sweet. That was literally a perfect slow ball right down the middle. You are stupid for not swinging at that. I think that robot's talking to me. All right, we'll swing at that one. <laughs> Wait, that's a really dumb idea. <laughs> Clanky just rolled that kid over. <laughs> Wow! Angela Delvecchio, you got a fluke double play in the first inning. Clanky will exterminate. Will you? Clanky will exterminate. I didn't say right this instant. Just it will inevitably happen in the near future. Haha, <laughs> you fool. You are a fool. Base is loaded with two outs, and it's Ricky Johnson. No chance that you advance everybody. <laughs> Zero. This inning is over. Don't underestimate Ricky Johnson, Mr. Clanky. Maybe Ricky hits uh, hits it out of the park. Impossible. He is the weakest batter in the entire game. Look at that. Scotty Roth is an easy catch, and he will just run on base. Ha, ha, ha. You lose Ricky Johnson. Wait till Clanky gets up on the plate. <laughs> then you will see a home run. Clanky, you're, you're not even that good of a batter. Clanky will show you. Robots will rule the world. Doggone it. See, I knew Francis Bluer would get out. Mr. Clanky is far superior. Here, Clanky! You know what, Clanky? I'm gonna just throw a slow ball down the middle. Let's see what you can do. Clanky will rip this out of the... Oops. Recalibrating. Hang on. Speed up. All right, Ronnie. <laughs> Not again! <laughs> Why does my sister always do this? <laughs> Sorry, Ronnie, but I just gotta put you in your place. Coach Artie's making me do it. Co 
Coach Artie's never picked me for his team. Uh, sorry, Ronnie. I, I totally will in a future season, but people wanted Sally. People always want Sally. I'll show you. Oh, darn it. Sorry, Ronnie, but Sally's the boss. Literally. <laughs> wow! <laughs> that, that was so mean. Oh, hey, we're back to the start of our lineup again. <laughs> Here we go. Harry Potter. <laughs> Listen, Potter been off your game as of recently. If you don't get a base hit here, you're living in the cupboard under the stairs again and Dudley gets his second bedroom back. Really? I do! Only if he misses. <laughs> Potter, that was a strike! <laughs> Alright, Potter, let's see you get on base. Very good, Harry. You don't end up in the cupboard this time. Here we go. Yoink! Nice slide, Harry! That's why he's got that speed! This short little Mexican kid is not getting a home run. See, he keeps fouling it. Robots for life. Darn it! Haha, <laughs> told you. Darn it. Everybody got on base. Does not compute. <laughs> oh my gosh! Plot twist of the century! There are no sliverings. The Potter Stinks is literally coming from Clanky, who has the recorded wave file. <laughs> that's amazing. No, no, that's canon now. <laughs> At least for this game. Haha, <laughs> Potter Stinks. Here we go. Here we go! <laughs> Impossible. Catch this, Raul. You are a professional baseball player. That is glorious. Well, that's suboptimal. That's not good. Well, Raul just showed us up. I mean, he is an adult, so... There we go. Here we go. Oh! Is that a... No, okay, it's not a Sydney... Run, run Harry! Come on! <laughs> oh, my gosh! No, no, go back, go back. No! Well, we still scored, but... Shoot, I should have played that better. I thought we had time to run. It's okay. We still scored, though. All right, Angela. I hope you got. I hope you got a little bit of a rest being in the outfield. All right. It's Jose Meisenheimer. Dane Ashley caught it with your head. <laughs> Ernie's like, oh boy. Okay, Randolph Gluker. This is the guy that randomly got like three home runs by getting pitched low and inside. So we're not doing that. We're gonna go high and inside. Oh yeah. I'm not pitching the elevator to Randolph Glucker, who is a- I must be all power. There we go. Oh my gosh. Pete. Pete! Move your donkey butt! Jeez Louise, you cannot make your kids move. If you click, it's totally random which kid moves towards it. Oh, it's just- It's a souffle. What's he gonna do? It's a foul. Dang, that was actually a really good hit if it wasn't foul! <laughs> there we go. Is this gonna be the rise of the souffle? I've made that joke too many times. Here, Vic. Oh, yeah! I forgot they had a special bat. Of course, it was the aluminum power bat. Hmm, well, that was not what I expected, but I guess good for the souffle? <laughs> Wait, how come then he didn't use that until the end? He fouled it twice, but neither of those were with the aluminum. How is it that he... Oh, a computer can definitely cheat with regards to that. I don't think it's possible for them to waste their aluminum power bat. It's like, they could use it, but if it happens to be a foul, it just will be... Oh, no, they didn't use the aluminum power bat. Well, this game got a little bit more interesting. But if people have good suggestions for the Vic Souffle theme song, then great. Okay, Pete... Pete has a problem where if you hold the click button to make him move somewhere, he won't move all the way there. You gotta click a whole bunch, and he still generally doesn't move. All right, Raul. You got a triple. Yeah, if people have ideas for the Vic Souffle theme song, please, please do that. 
Pete! Un... I cannot stand Pete it being this uncooperative. It's driving me nuts. Oh, Dane! A Angela is gassed already! She was full on juice at the start of the inning. Yikes! We might have to actually sub in a couple different pitchers this game. Look, it is. Doinky, doinky, boink. Nice strikeout, Angela. Good job. Ernie, get a home run right now and send Mr. Clanky packing. I want to. I actually just want to see more or less if, when we get five points, if they immediately take Clanky out, because that would seem to indicate that, that theory is true. I don't know. It was last win. Talk on it, Ernie. <laughs> oh, sorry! Uh-oh. Uh, 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 there we go. Boop, boop, boop. Yes! Yes! Okay. Football-headed kid. Football-headed kid is bad. <laughs> he keeps dropping stuff. All right, Angela. I know you're minus one in batting, but you still got the power. You got the power. Not swinging at that one, though. <laughs> yeah, AI is taking over baseball. First it was art, then chat GPT came along, and then, uh, well, one thing led to another, and now and now robots are allowed to play in Little League Baseball, you know? It just, I can't believe it. I can. Robots make for much more interesting baseball. Shut up, Clanky! <laughs> Does not compute. Oh, that should be illegal. You should not be able to give children concussions in baseball. I would be interested to see a nine Clanky game. <laughs> Maybe not in season play, though. Maybe, Actually, I don't think you could do that in season play. Ricky, we need you to to deliver. It, at least advance one person and get on base. We don't want a double play, though. Because, unfortunately, next up is Harry Potter, and he also just really is not going to be able to get a good hit either. So, we really need this. Maybe, maybe Clanky will walk you. Haha. <laughs> you wish. In your dreams, loser. That's too low. That's not too low. Ha ha ha. Now I can Hadouken the ball. Later, loser. Harry, we're going power. Because it's home run or bust at this point. Because Angela's on base. If Harry doesn't hit a home run here, that is an out. Because Angela is gassed and she has to advance. No chance it happens if we don't hit it out of the park. What? That was so far over here! Okay, that's so weird. Angela was totally gassed at the end of last inning. This inning, she even had to run? But now she has like all her juice back, so I guess she burns through her juice quickly, but gets it back quickly. I can work with this. Okay, Harry? No, Harry! Oh my gosh, why are my catchers so bad? Is this just a catcher thing to not go where you tell them to? I bet they have another aluminum power bat. Having said that, though, never seen Clanky get a home run, but I also really don't want them to tie up the game. Not an aluminum power bat, but that is the most powerful hit I've ever seen Clanky get in my entire life. Ha 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 ha, loser! Sally, get out Ronnie. We got to. I'm scared, because Ronnie is powerful. He can really knock it out of the park. <laughs> Older sisters have no mercy, Ronnie. Look at that energy he's giving it. Oh man, if, if Ronnie home runs it here, then they're in the lead. No, don't vote for Ronnie! We don't want Ronnie to score! Oh, thank goodness. Strike out. Sally just keeps absolutely savagely burning Ronnie Dobbs and making him cry. I don't like it. This is rough. Because Jose's got power, and then after this, it's Randolph, who got all of those home runs last game. Oh, this is real tough. Like, okay, maybe we can double play it. Shoot, I... You know what? We at least got him out. Okay, it's Randolph not pitching it low and inside. Not doing it. Yes, there we go. Ricky, this is you. This is you, Ricky. Ricky, this is you. Ricky, that was you! 
Sally's there to save it. Why is it impossible to move your characters underneath where the ball's going to land? They either stop short or they go too far. You can't make them go right where it is. Phew! Still though. Sally is breaking her back carrying this team. She really is. Here we go, Ashley. Let's beat the robot. Impossible. Clanky will be victorious. Damn! We gave the guy a concussion, but he still broke his rib. <laughs> but, like, he still got it. That's dedication. Pablo, I'll be honest, your power hits have been a little disappointing today. It's probably because we're in a position where we're in the lead and he doesn't need to pull out all the stops. But I would like you to pull out all the stops. <gasps> Do that again, Clanky. I dare you. <laughs> a dare, is it? Robots don't care about dares. Pablo! Where's the power? <laughs> that kid just pushed Clanky over! I hate humans. <laughs> this would not happen if there were nine Clankies. <laughs> oh, that power! It's still going to hit the Jumbotron, though. But it's okay. It's okay. Okay. Maybe we can go to third. Maybe we can get an inside the park home run. We get an inside the park home run! Sally Dobbs! Oh my gosh! Sally's back is gonna be so broken after. And they push Clicky over again! Cursed humans! Let me play baseball! Okay, will they swap out Clinky? Yes, they do! Okay! So that, that seems to be the case. You get five points, they swap the pitcher. Oh no, right to Clanky. <laughs> I kind of forgot Clanky's left arm is just a literal baseball cannon. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> no, now it's time for the real boss fight. <laughs> Sally was the warm-up. Ernie's the real boss. Oh, hey, Don. <laughs> Sorry, gotta recalibrate! <laughs> you you understand what it's like, Clinky. Oh, indeed. Right to Clink! Here you go! Catch this, you stupid robot! See? <laughs> Ernest, you get a single! <laughs> uh, I don't understand why robots are able to play baseball. <laughs> Seems like it goes against the rules of Little League. I don't, I, I don't know, man. I'm just a kid named Jose. They asked me to join their Little League team. I literally did not realize that there was going to be a robot on the team, alright? I understand, Jose. The world's going crazy. Yeah, man. It really is. <laughs> anyway, so sorry I'm going to have to strike you out here, Pete. <laughs> hey, CRK. What's up? Oh, man. Nice hit, dude. <laughs> but unfortunately, if he's going to catch that. <laughs> Jose's the only normal person on their team. He's just a normal kid. It's like, do you want to play for the Canada... Or the Canada? <laughs> do you want to play for the Toronto Blue Jays? He's like, uh, yes. They're like, by the way, this is the team captain. A literal robot. He's like, what? <laughs> okay, Vic Souffle's back. He's not getting a home run this time. The robot is younger than the pro, so he definitely fit. The, the, the pro shouldn't be here. <laughs> Jose Meisenheimer joins Little League to discover a 50-year-old man and a robot on the team. He's like, this... What? What? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Vic. <laughs> Chef, Chef Pierre Souffle will rise again. <laughs> Scotty Roth. Scotty is such a 2000s kid's name. Back in the 2000s, you had... Oh, Angela. Oh. No, no. Her Oh no! How is he able to do that? <laughs> Doug Gunn and Ernie? Speaking of full grown adult, hi Raul. I was a big fan of you when you were on British Bake Off, even though that was a different Raul. <laughs> he had a lot of talent though. <laughs> Alright, if you want to go to first, go for it. I'll get out Scotty. <laughs> Yeah, I feel like, yeah, 2000 it was like Scotty, Cody, Skyler, and nowadays it's like, I named my kid Semicolon, because it's unique. It's like, yeah, but it's also stupid. 
This has been Artie's hot take for the day. Another hot take from Artie. Bible names never go out of style. But also, be careful with that. Like, you don't want to name your daughter Jezebel. Or Molech. Like, that, be smart with it. Alright. Jay Green is still frightening, but he's 0 for 2. Well, he's not 0 for 2 anymore! <laughs> wow! Okay, no. Do not let Raul get deferred. Ricky! He's freaking gonna do Yeah! Take it! Eat that, Raul! <laughs> get off the Little League team! Sally Dobbs hard carrying us, along with the Weber Twins. He has Shuka Pop, let's get a home run. Hey Jose, how you doing? Oh, oh wow! That was easy! <laughs> when I said get a home run, Angela took that- She's like, I took that seriously. <laughs> um, no, sorry, I think today Sally Dobbs is. But Angela, you're also heavily carrying us. You probably shouldn't pitch it left when they're open. Well, th here's the thing. They can be open, but then if you pitch it outside, they can also change their stance midway. So it, I don't think it means a whole lot, but I will keep that in mind, though. Thank you, CRK. Ricky oh, it's Ricky. Oh, I sure hope I can get on base today. <laughs> Just hit it to the robot, Ricky. You'll be fine. But everyone else who hit it to the robot got out. <laughs> Yeah, but you'll get on, Ricky, because you won't hit it all the way to him. Oh, that's right! <laughs> Ricky's too nice of a guy to... <laughs> Ricky, I know you're a nice guy, but you, you still gotta hit it with the power! But as a line drive. Ah, that's what we're looking for. Oh no! Clanky was intelligent! He played in for Ricky! <laughs> I know this kid. I have detailed profiles on every single kid in the Little League. Ricky can't hit it past his nose. Play in. <laughs> oh, it's Harry Potter. This kid also can't hit past his nose. Play in. <laughs> Doggone it, Clanky! <laughs> Stop it with your cheating. Not cheating, just smart. Harry Potter must beat the robots. Fantasy's better than science fiction. Obviously. Okay, that was, that was me. I swung too early. All right, Ashley. Uh, here we go. Possibly our last at bat. Boosh! Over their heads. Over their heads. Don't capture this. No, it's Jay Green. He captures it. Darn it. That was our last at bat. Why is it every time I have a bat, it's always these three losers in the same order? <laughs> oh, what? How serendipitous. Mr. Clanky second has a ways. <laughs> Stupid Clanky. <laughs> Francis, shouldn't you be playing baseball with, uh, Gloria and Albert? Oh, wait. Wow, Ricky! Way to show up! <laughs> oh, boy. Time for a weird voice, Mr. Clanky. <laughs> I've basically been doing it the whole game. Angela Delvecchio, you are tired, so Clanky will get a very good hit. Whoops. Need to recalibrate. <laughs> I was expecting you to pitch it a little higher. Take this, Clanky! Slow ball. Haha, <laughs> look at that power. I can't tell if Clanky's in or out. You know what? Let's play risky. We'll short circuit him. No! He hit the slow ball! Or he hit the spitball! No, are you kidding me? No, 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 no. Don't throw it now! Are you. Are you for real, people? Are you for real? With what just everyone blatantly moved away from the ball. Oh boy, I sure hope Clanky doesn't move to third base. <laughs> oh, I really hope Clanky doesn't move to third base. That would be bad. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> Do you think robots are stupid? <laughs> We don't take unnecessary risks. Oh, no. <laughs> That's not good. And look at his derp face back there. We have a special bat. We got free aluminum power bats. You have no shot. I thought the spitball would short circuit him because water and electricity. Boy, was I dumb. All right. Ronnie can't do anything against Sally. 
No. Not the crazy. I was about to be Clanky's not moving. No. Oh no, that's the worst. Why did it have to go to Angela? Ashley Weber is off the team. That's like the third time in a row she would refuse to move and then blatantly ran away from the ball. <sighs> Ashley is off the team next season. If we don't get Angela out of the outfield, that's just going to happen again. Maybe they don't have crazy bunts anymore. Get him out. Get him out. Oh, yeah, Ronnie's out. Double play. That's the game. <laughs> we weren't in any danger, but it was still annoying that Ashley did that. <laughs> Except Ashley, we're leaving her at the bus stop. 